Hello everybody, it's Lucas McIntosh here and I'm back with some more Alien Trilogy for the PlayStation 1 and I'm doing Mission 3 I believe, Section 1 Mission 3. Now I want to explain something before I start this mission. Um, essentially, if you complete the mission but you don't get a very high percentage rating then you will tend to skip a mission. What I mean by that is I'm on Mission 3 now. Now, I think Mission 3 might be a bonus stage. Now, if I didn't do 100% of the mission, or if I only got, like, I don't know, 50% or under in the last mission, then the bonus level will not unlock, and you'll go to, like, 1-4 straight away instead of 1-3. So that's typically how this game works. So you kind of need to explore every part of a level, or try to anyway, to get the most from this, and to try and unlock those bonus rounds, because they are literally essential. I'm probably not going to get everyone, but I will try my best. So, here we go guys, let's continue the game. And I think this is a bonus round, I'm pretty sure it is. Mission Brief, you may rearm your arsenal here by... But we can only hover for 60 seconds. So yeah, you got 60 seconds, it was like Supermarket Streep. Supermarket Streep? Sweep, I should say. So you've got 60 seconds to pick up as many stuff as you can. The area is about to self-destruct. Ensure that you arm up before we pull you out. So you need to move very quickly, guys. There's no aliens on here. So I think you can kind of get what you want. Um, and you've got that freedom. But again, you've got to hurry up. You cannot mess around. There's a medikit there, so we'll take that. And there's like another medikit there. So shotgun cartridges, derm patch. So I'm going to go this way because there's some goodies this way and I just want to use that. Alright, go this way. I think I might be able to pick up a weapon here or something. Seismic charges. Got the wall. Oh, yeah, these are so cool, these hidden bonus rounds. I'm collecting flamethrower fuel as well because I will be needing that a lot later on. Definitely. Right. I've got the adrenaline burst, guys. Oh, I would if I could, but I don't want to. Alright, 10 seconds, guys. 10 seconds. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. There you go, guys. So I've got some flamethrower fuel, so I'm not doing too badly. So let's continue the game. I don't think I'll, I'll need to save it because... Yeah, this next mission isn't too difficult. Right, it says the recapture of the colony is progressing well. However, as we have feared, our security people have been infected and must be eliminated. Power up all of the lights, destroy anything that lives and pull out so that we may remove any carcasses and secure the area for rehabilitation. So yeah, the security people are like the most annoying enemies on this game. They just pop out of nowhere. They take quite a few shots to kill. Well, about three shots. They're not that bad, but yeah. It can be annoying, so get rid of them as quickly as you can. Let's just blast them. They take between two to three blasts. I always kill them straight away. And just makes it easy for me when I come back this way. I don't want to have to be dealing with them later on. So, ooh. I just realised, guys, I've got like 196 health. I'm like, how did that happen? So there we go, I've taken care of them. So I'm going to just use use that to my advantage though, guys. Because I'm going to just rush through and I'm going to get the uh, shoulder lamp and the battery. So you, I think you're supposed to like turn the valves off. But I'm like, no, I've got more, more health, more than enough. So I can kind of just get through, take a bit of damage. And at least I've got, at least I've got some stuff anyway. So it's not too bad. Right. Xenomorph hiding there, little bugger. I was expecting them to be honest, so it didn't kind of start on me. I was like, oh yeah, it's got to be a Xenomorph there. Let's just get rid of these bloody crates, get them out of the way. There we are. Oh. Really trying to aim for that barrel there, but it's not hitting, not hitting the mark. Oh, let me guess, this is a Xenomorph, right? Come on, then. I'm trying to, trying to hit the barrels, but it's not working. I 
I'm actually hitting the barrels. Well, there you go, but it's not working. For whatever reason, the barrels are not blowing up. I guess you've got to be, like, dead on or something. But you think, in, in, in like, using real-world physics, not that I'm a mathematician or anything, but in the real world, I'd probably be able to hit that barrel, no problem. But, well, this is a video game, so... And there we are. I've closed the steam valves. Now, maybe I should have done that first, but you know what? Uh, time is of the essence, I think. Stick to all this. Alright, and then switch to my handgun, because I don't know why I'm wasting shotgun shells on these guys, because they're really not worth it. Wait, where's it gone? Got it. There you go. Cool. So I think that's where I started from. So I started from here, right? Oh, there's another one. All right. Johnny come lately. All right. The wreck area. Okay. This is the one with the pool, isn't it? With the acid vest. So when I put the lights on, I think an acid vest um, appears in the pool. That's what I remember distinctly about this uh, level. Just having a look. I think it only appears once the lights are on though, so I've got to power up this area somehow. Ah. Right. With the lights on, I can go back, I think. vest so that's got some armor guys how cool is that it's gonna keep me safe so I need to stop again I need to tell myself to stop using my bloody shotgun on those things on those little face holders because I'm gonna run out of ammo so I really need to take my own advice on this game here I am telling you guys to conserve ammo and I'm wasting it willy-nilly oh my god right I don't understand. Can I not go anywhere else in this area? Right, there's a medikit there, so... I powered up the lights, so it's this way, isn't it, I think? Is it this way? Oh, it just leads me back to the pool. It's just like one giant leap. Alright, I take it that there's nowhere else I can go then, if it's just going to leap me around. Alright, let's pop down here. got to be that's the wreck area so that's where I've come in all right maybe I can find some discarded shotgun shells there's a door there okay um oh there's more of them more security guards guys Let's get rid of them stop them in their tracks all right and there's two doors well three doors that I cannot open yet so, how do I open those? Oh, well, that one was just like, oh, you just open it. The other two I can't open, but I've got rid of some creatures. Let me guess, another Xenomorph? Yeah, there's definitely another Xenomorph. Always is for me. Come on, then. Come on, then. I've got him blocked by the table, though, so I was able to get a few shots in before he could... Oh, there's another one. Got ya. Right, okay. These dome patches are really helping as well. Build my uh, health up. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm running out of shotgun gels. It's, it's not major, but... Oh god, just go away. Will you... These animals just leave me alone. Got ya. That was tough. I don't mind saying, guys, that was really tough. I can't get through that door. So, I don't think there's any switches in this room to be to be pulled or anything. Right, let me just check over here. Let me just check this door. Once I check this door, I know, I'll know that I've come through here. Yeah, I've come through there. I had, just had to make sure because I got a bit lost. 
So what we need to do is, um, I think, go this way. Personnel. Right, let's go up here. Oh, for God's sake. Is it any wonder you run out of ammo? They just keep throwing xenomorphs at you all the time. Oh, and there's more steam valves. Right, I'm going to just glitch through though. There we are, we'll take flamethrower fuel and all the other stuff. Sub the steam valves. I might wait for it to stop actually, if it does. I can get through. Oh, you know what, let's get through. A bit of damage isn't going to hurt. When there's a door that I just I just can't get through that door yet, so... Right, have I been everywhere? Yeah, I've been everywhere this way. So I can't open that door yet, so I obviously do need to come back here. But as you can see, guys, there's parts of the level that I think are hidden or secret. So I need to find out how to unlock them. If I can't, then that's okay, but I just want you guys to know I'm doing my best. So we're activated. Ah, here we go. Now I should be able to get through those hidden doors. I've acti it says I've activated the lift as well. I don't know where that lift is. Maybe it's in this room somewhere. Ah, it's down here, isn't it? I remember now. Alright, what's down here? Oh, let's get my gun out. My standard pistol. There's lots of derm patches down here, though, I think. Nice, so I'm building up my health. I've got a nice, nice, nice little collection of health going on, but it probably won't last, I my luck. Right, let's get rid of these crates. Boom. Give me some shotgun shells and I'll be happy. Give me some shells, come on. Oh, right. Oh, there's a switch here to press, isn't there? So I will be, I will be pressing that in a minute. I just want to get rid of all these bloody crates first. Yes! More shotgun cartridges. Oh my god, that's made my day. Really has. I could always use more shotgun shells. Oh my god. Really? Oh, that thing's gonna die now. Anyway. Yeah, you wanna check everywhere because you will find some valuable items. Right, what does this do? It says it activates a door. So, is this some sort of secret lift? I don't know. Right, okay, let's use the, uh, use the radar. Let me see the, let me see the uh, face of this. Oh my god, they kind of slide down as well creepily and they try and hit you. As I said, if you land in them, if you step on them, then you will take damage because their blood is acid off. You know, so that's one thing that's very consistent with this game and the films. Blood is acid, right? Oh, there's another one there. However, he got caught in my line of sight, so I shot him. Oh, yes. That's how you do it. Right, I think I've run out of bullets, guys. Yeah, I've run out of handgun bullets, if you can believe that. So, yeah. All right, I'm not. Oh, all right. I'm just gonna say, guys. I think there's some handgun ammunition at the beginning of the level I can pick up, so I can probably go back and pick it up once I've cleared the area, cleared the way. I think this is one of those doors that I couldn't get to before. Oh, there's another. Another xenomorph there, okay. So now this door's open. Oh, it's freeing the other xenomorphs, I see. I understand now. So I should be able to get through some of these other doors. Oh, hello, mate. Goodbye. Yes, 9mm ammunition. Let's go and get some ammunition. Off the dead guys before we do anything. We'll take that. Yes. I've got my got my ammunition back, so not not too bad, guys. Is this where I started from? Yeah, this is where I started from. I've got to keep remembering that. Right now, we'll go back this way and let's see. There were doors. See, there's still areas that I haven't uncovered on this game. Is that a, is that not a door? Or is that just a wall? This is door number four.
So they all kind of link in with each other, which is kind of cool. But I could do with some seismic charges. That's what I could really could do with right now. I've already been here, so that's taking it there. So, okay. Let's go this way. Use the map. I try and use the map as much as I can now, I think. That's probably the best thing to do. Right, let's take me that way. It seems to take me that way, so I don't think the map always takes you in the direction you think you're going in. So, alright, so at least we've established what those doors are. Right, okay. So, having done that. can't get into that area wherever it is. However, I'm going to see if there's anywhere else I can go here. Or if there's anywhere else I haven't been. Seems to be, I think there's something like on the ground floor. Somewhere I haven't been. Right, have I been... I've been everywhere here. So... I'm going to do my best. Right, where is it I'm, I need to go? Okay, now it's taking me away from where I need to go. Right, what's here? I don't, I don't quite understand whether I, whether going upstairs will help me. I think going upstairs might actually hinder me. There's areas, guys, I just haven't been to. So I'm gonna have a sweet round. Hope you don't mind. Yes, there's a guy here. Don't think I've been this way. Yeah, it's like things like that. You see, there's enemies everywhere. And more have appeared kind of this way, so it kind of generates more more baddies. There you go, that's how you do it. Well you don't you never know until you try. Right, we'll pop down here. Ah, this is new. This is definitely new guys. I I don't think I've been here guys before. Right, we're going this way. Oh! There you go. Boom. Right, okay. And we have... Oh, an auto mapper. See, that reveals the area. That reveals the levels, guys. And it looks like there's a hidden area as well. That I've not found. Ah, leads me out here. How cool is that? Nice, and it leads me here. Right, okay. See, there's a hidden area. So, it reveals, I think... I'm going to see if I can get it. I haven't got any um, seismic charges, unfortunately, but... Um, I'm going to see if I can find it anyway. Okay. Would it be this way? No, it, I think it wants me to go up here. That's okay. If I don't, if I don't manage to get it, that's okay with me. But I just want you to know I'm really trying to find everything. Right. Okay. I think it's this way. It's telling me it's a door. It's telling me it's like here. Where is it? I don't understand why. Okay. Is it here? Yeah, it's got to be here, but I can't... If it's here, guys, I just can't get to it. It's like right behind... I think it's like right behind this wall, but I I don't have any seismic charges or any... Or whatever I need to get through, so... Yeah, that sucks. Oh, well. well. That's not too bad. I guess I might as well just try and finish the level then. Unless... Unless it's up and not down, I don't know. Maybe it's up. That could be possible. Maybe it's not. Yeah, maybe it's actually up here. So I'm going to try and go round. Yeah, it could be like here. Be like a hidden thing there. I haven't any seismic charges, as I said, so. However, I do have tons of health, so I. Even though I've probably missed a few things, I've actually done pretty well when it comes to health. So now I suppose I might as well exit this area. 
and just try and try and leave this area if I can and get to the next stage. But um, do you how I'm like I mean one of those where do I go moments now? Oh my god! If only I had some seismic charges, I would be sorted. All right, where am I going? Can I not go back? I wish I knew where I was going. Right, that's where I've been, okay? So I've been there. Right, that much is true. So let's go this way. Let's try and figure it out. I think it's got to be this way. I'm sure it is. Right, that leads me to there. This leads me to the lift. I'm just going to go down here, I think. Because I think there's like... A yeah, as I've just seen another bloody face with it. Oh, and another one. So I'm trying to kill as many as I can because they... Oh! Hidden crates, guys. Hidden crates that I just did not get last time. Oh, I know I'm contradicting myself. But... Oh, seismic charges! Right, now I can go to the hidden stuff, guys. I can actually go to the hidden wall. This is exciting. Right, let's go to that hidden wall. Nice. So that's where the seismic charges were. Okay. Right, okay. Um, I need to go... Oh. It's this way. So now I can go back out this room. Which is this way, I think. Right. Now let's go this way. Yeah, this is it, guys. This is it. I think I found it. Possibly. This should take me to... The, if, if there is a hidden room here, guys, then I think I'm going to find it. Right, would it be up here? I think it was round here. Was it up and round here or something? Oh, where is it? Yeah, I'm, I'm close to it. I'm close to it. This way? No. It wants me to go a little bit like this way. Something like that. I don't think the, the wall's actually there, though. I think it's like... I'm going to say it's down below. Alright, yeah. I think it might be down below, right. Will it take me that way, though? It won't take me that way. Okay, what about going this way? What about this way? Oh, God. This is so stupidly annoying. Yeah, see, I'm close to it now, but I can't find it. It just keeps taking me away from where it is, so... It's ten minutes here, then. So it must be... No. Okay, what well, is it here? What about here? Is it here? I need to be, like, right on it, but I can't get on it. It's got to be here, then. It's not, it's not letting me get to it for whatever reason, guys. It's not letting me... Right, well, let's have a look. Ah, so I'm right by it now. Let's try this. No, it's got to be around the other side. So, I, I do apologise. I've just wasted one, but I had to be sure that it wasn't there. So, it's got to be around the other side. So, I need to go like all the way around in a circle. This has got to be it. No? I don't understand this at all. Why would you put a secret with, with no way of getting to it? Unless it's on the top. Maybe it's on the... It's, it's not here anywhere, is it? No, it's not here. Right, okay. Oh. Right, so I don't know where it's supposed to be, guys. I have no friggin' idea. Um, so I'm going to try going down. But it's like you can't get it from down here. This is stupid. Alright, Richard, come on. Come on, you can do this. Oh my god. Tell me it's this way. I'm probably not doing this guys but I, I'm trying my best to figure this out I don't know where where it expects me to go but where it expects me to go is there's, there's like nowhere to go 
Well, it's take, it just keeps taking me back the other way. I don't want to waste it is the thing. If I, I, I don't know if it's in that corner, but I don't particularly want to waste it if it is. Okay. Yeah, it's saying it's right there, but it isn't because it. it I'll, I'll try it. No. So it's probably on the other side. So I probably just wasted that, guys. But I'm so sorry. I just can't find it. I've done my best anyway. Um, that's really all I can do. So, but at least I've got shed loads of health and stuff. I thought I'd check it out anyway. I just I don't know where it's supposed to be. It's ridiculous. So anyway, I might as well just try and finish the level now. I just can't believe I just I just can't find it. I I just could not find it whatsoever. But I have tried anyway. At least I know where those seismic charges are anyway for future use. Right. So where am I going? Like there's all these doors. Let's open door number two. I still can't get door number two open for whatever reason. Door number four is activated though. Um, there's got to be a way out somewhere. Oh, please. I'm, I just want to get out of here now. I think that would be a good idea. Just want to finish the level. Have a nice cup of tea. Uh, what's down here? Oh. I'm down here near the lift, so. So this is like a lift, this is the, the lift area, I should say. Okay. I just want to get out of here. I, I, you know, I just want to finish the level, but I can't find the end of the level. Oh my god, it's like ridiculous. I'm following the map as well, it's like, you'd think I'd find it by now. Alright, what's this door? No, that's just where I've been. So I, I think maybe this ramp. Yeah, up this ramp I think will take me to it. We've got steam valves which have been shut off. And there we go, guys. I'm so sorry that took a little bit longer than necessary, guys. But I did my very best. I didn't find all the secrets. Uh, as you can see, there's one that just eluded me. But um, I did kill 92% the end and I did do 100% the mission. So there you go, guys. And I'm going to end the video here. So thank you very much. This has been Lucas McIntosh. Thank you so much for taking the time to check out my retro play channel and my videos. Please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe to the support channel. Keep checking back for new retro content. And please don't forget to give me some feedback as well. Check me out on Twitter for all the latest happenings on my channel and my website, lucasmackintosh.com, for written reviews, retro reviews, and horror movie reviews too. Thank you very much, and I'll see you next time for some more Alien Trilogy for the PlayStation 1.